All right, so I thought I would give this another try uh, with a lead sled here, but this will be another Lockhart Tactical Raven accuracy test. So the two different types of ammunition will be Remington 223 and then Hornady, and then I'll take the best and worst. So the best last time was Norinco, the worst last time was Winchester White Box. So there we go. Now let's see how they shoot. So I'll be shooting Hornady first, Remington, Winchester White Box, and Norinco. And then just for myself, it'll be in a counterclockwise order. And then I'll take my time a bit more with these targets there. Up next will be Remington. Winchester white box. Last one, and we're in go. Okay, let's go walk down there, see what I did to them targets. Alright, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that target style shooting rather than practical style shooting, uh, where I used a lead sled and I shot a lot slower. Uh, so this target is kind of a little bit uh, sprayed up because I only brought one when I shot. So here's a picture of where it started before this test. So I circled all of the ones not applicable to this because I shot this with a different platform. Um, so I should have mentioned that the Hornady was 68 grain, uh, boat tail hollow point. And that one came in at two inches on a five round group. You can see these two are touching here, but the other three, I don't know what happened to it. So the Remington was the worst of the day coming in at three inches. So you can see uh, these four here. And then that flyer really opened it up right there. The Winchester uh, since I shot it in another video, it had a 3.25 inch group and this shrunk down to uh, 2.25. So there is a one, one inch reduction in it. So I guess I should specify the ammunition that I shot 
uh, before was from, I think, 2001. This stuff was current production, 2023. So maybe it's better, or maybe I just made a mistake last time shooting the Winchester. And then this little sticky fell off, uh, but 1.5 inches for Norinco. That is very impressive. And then shooting it in a bench rather than a... Um, rather than just off of an ammo box, I shrunk it by a quarter inch. So I guess the takeaway on that is I'm very disappointed in the Hornady considering the price of it. Uh, but I guess another takeaway that I found and I think that you should take away from it is it doesn't matter what ammunition you run. Try a bunch of different kinds of ammunition because so far I tried six different and still the Norinco comes out on top and you wouldn't have expected that you would have expected that Hornady would come out on top every gun is different uh, it's almost like an engine every engine will perform a little bit different every load in your gun will perform a little bit different so unfortunately with all of this information you'll still have to go out and shoot and see what your gun likes and I mean I don't really have a whole lot of vested interest in any of this so this is real groups these are five round groups um, if you go online you'll see people like erasing groups trying to prove something I'm not trying to sell anything I don't have a vested interest I don't have a stake in the game whether you buy this rifle or this ammunition or not so I really don't care I wanted to see how it would run in my specific gun in my specific gun Norinco is the winner so take from that what you will uh, thank you very much for watching if you liked it, feel free to like it. If you didn't dislike it all you want, thanks for watching and have a good one.